Bye, Canada. It's been real. Oh my gosh. Four to six weeks later. Yeah, guys, we're off the, you know? Family, bless our family, we're off the, you know? Try to take off the things, them. After we're off, you see it. Busy, busy, busy. Yeah, Rasta people, why? Clearing a vehicle is a very expensive venture, you know? But there, you know, finally, it's like, um, well, I laid up in the day, you know, almost at 6 o'clock now. I've been out from, like, um, I've been out here from morning, you know? But you've got thanks to vehicle clear. Yeah, the car is here. Never been so happy to see my car. Oh, it's locked. <laughs> Ooh, yeah, it's just way more convenient having your own car here. You can't trust other people's cars. Yeah, you don't really know <laughs> what condition their car is. Sometimes they don't even have working seat belts. No it's AC. just you're just praying no when you're out there. No lights, no AC. No brakes. So yeah. So <laughs> we have our car. The kids are safe in the back. Seat belts, car seats, everything going. And we know how our car operates. And you're the only one who's ever driven this car. Really, yeah. So Rentals get costly. Ubers. Sometimes they don't want to drive certain places, so that's kind of like unreliable if you have to do something. So this is good. This, it's well worth it to us so yeah so our stuff is here they dropped it off but yeah this is it you can't really record at the wharf so whatever footage we got yeah that's what we got but it was an easy process and there was like seven people moving everything in which was great so we didn't have to do that but yeah, so happy to have the stuff here in our car. <laughs> 